Today's lesson, section 2.7b, and we're also talking about one-to-one -one functions and their inverses like we did the last section of 2.7. Uh, here, what we're going to talk about is um, how to find an inverse, um, not using the graph, but um, a little bit more analytically. So, um, now this one's probably one that you've seen before. Um, now, there's two different ways of doing it. Um, it doesn't matter which way you use, um, whichever one makes more sense to you is fine by me, just as long as you're showing your steps, that's all that matters. Okay, so the first way is on the left. Um, you can, well, for each of these parts, always first take your f of x or whatever of x it is, like g of x or h of x, um, change it to y. Okay, that's the first step for both. Um, it makes it a lot easier to deal with it when it's y, not f of x. Okay. Now for the first way is, let's say you have your y, then the next part is solving your equation for x. Okay. So you move everything around, get x by itself, and then what you want to do is switch x and y. And so now y is equal to f inverse of x. Okay. So that's the first way. Second way is very similar, just switching two steps. So you switched your f of x to y. The second part is you interchange your x and y. Okay. And then from there you solve for your or you solve the equation for y. Okay? So and it, but it gets you the same answer no matter what. Okay, and I'll show you both. Um, like I said, it doesn't matter which one you use. Okay. So example five, um, I'm going to do the first way. So here, if I have f of x equals 3x minus 2, like I said, first change it to y. Okay, now the first way says solve for x. Okay, so I'm going to get x by itself by adding 2. And then divide by 3. Okay, so then that means that I get um, x equals y plus 2 over 3, okay, and then the last step, like I said, you switch your y and your x, so now y equals x plus 2 over 3, and that would be my inverse, okay. The next part, um, g of x is equal to x cubed minus 5 all over 4. Okay, so let's do it the other way. So, first I want to switch g of x to y. Okay, then I want to switch x and y. Okay, now remember if you have a power, the power doesn't come with the x. I'm just switching the x and putting it where the y is, and I'm putting the y where the x is. So now, x is equal to y cubed minus 5 over 4, okay? So those two values are the only things that moved. Everything else stayed exactly the same. And then from here, like I said earlier, I want to solve for y. So I would multiply both sides by 4 get out of the denominator. I get 4x equals y cubed minus 5. Okay? And then from there, I'm going to add 5 to both sides. Okay? And then, because it has a cube root, or a cube power, I'm going to take the cube root to get rid of it. So now y equals the cube root of 4x plus 5. And that would be my inverse. Okay? And then for this last one, now here sometimes you have um, multiple x values um, to deal with. Um, there's no special way of doing this. Um, first, like always, take your h of x and make it a y. And then here, you, uh, 
you can do whatever you can switch um, your stuff well but we keep it like the first way where we wait to the end and solve for x instead um, okay so so I multiply both sides by x minus 7 okay and I'm going to multiply this through okay so I get x y minus 7 y to x plus 5 um, now I want to get my x's on the same side okay so I have it solved for x so I'm going to move 2x over Oops. and I'm going to add the 7y back over so I can get it by itself so now you have xy minus 2x equals 7y plus 5 and then here because they have both x's in common I'm going to factor out an x I'm going to divide both sides by y minus 2 to get x by itself So now, now I know that I have two. I know that I have two y's over here, but I still switch the y's with the x. So x will go here to replace that y, and x will go here to replace that y. But there will only be one y on the left side. Okay, so I don't think there's two. So y will equal seven x plus five over x minus 2 and that will be my new inverse for this function okay have fun